Nathan, congratulations. Two wins from three games. Would you have taken that at the start? Uh, yeah. Um, you know, I, I've set myself a target coming into it. Um, you know, minimum six out of ten. Um, be over the moon with eight. Happy with seven. So, uh, yeah, I, I, I'm on track. Um, it was a big win tonight after, obviously, the disappointment from last night. I felt like I deserved a draw from last night. Um, bounce back. And uh, yeah, I think it shows where my 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 my, um, my mindset's at. You know, I'm playing well. I know I can beat anyone in the in this tournament, and uh, I've proved that tonight. You know, world number four. Um, you know, could have been seven two. Um, but yeah, big win, and very happy with the two points. You touched on it there after losing four legs on the spin to Dimitri. Was it important you got out the gate quickly this evening? Yeah, um, yeah, I think so. Um, obviously, last night. To be, to be fair, he missed a lot of doubles early on. I could have been, you know, dead and buried, to be fair. So that one four four out and that, that kind of kicked me on. Um, but obviously, like you say, I lost four legs on the bounce. But to be fair, no fault of my own. Fantastic darts from Dimmy. Um, but yeah, it was important to come out uh, fighting and coming out strong. Um, and, and that's what I did. I put him under pressure from, from the first dart that I threw. And uh, yeah, got the two, two points. And yeah, I, I'm, I'm happy with my game. Five one up tonight. Do you feel you let James back into the game and almost gave him a sniff? Me and it, Phil. That's what I do. Um, I don't know what it is. Um, I get these leads, and I don't know. I just, it does me head in, to be fair. I don't purposely take my foot off the gas, but self-consciously, I don't know. I must do. Um, so yeah, that was the one thing I was disappointed with tonight. That obviously this could. This is so tight, this Premier League. It could come down to leg difference and maybe two or three legs I uh, gave away there. But, you know, at this early stage, big two points and that's all I'm bothered about tonight. You touched on how tight this is. Apart from Glenn, obviously we can see his notice to be struggling. Everyone else is in and around each other and this, this could be one of the tightest Premier Leagues we've ever seen. Yeah, definitely. I think last year was really tight as well. Um, but, you know, just a little word on Glenn. Good pal to Glenn. He's... He's really struggling, but he's going up there and he's trying his heart out. Um, you, you know, I don't think, to be fair, he's getting much stick, to be fair, on social media. Nice. And he shouldn't get it. He shouldn't get it because it's hard. Um, you know, I've had to dip in form and it's hard to keep going up there battling and he's going to come back tomorrow. And, you know, I hope I just hope he gets that first point on the ball because he's a great guy and he's, he's a Premier League champion. And, you know, hopefully he can come back and, you know, give us all the game. Because that's what he, he should be doing, but um, yeah, it's it is very tight. You know what I mean? It, I think come Friday you'll you'll get a little bit of an indication of who's where uh, after five games. But yeah, I would like to put a bet on who's going to uh, get in the top four this year. Just touching on what you said there, about the, <laughs> just touching on what you said about the dips in form and then the fact that you've been through it. Is it worse in these blocks because it's like being in a goldfish bowl? Everything's magnified. There's no escape for you guys or anything like that. Does that make it a hundred times worse? Yeah, I think so. I think obviously, um, like I said, there's no escape. Um, it's night in, night out. Uh, it's, you know, it's not like pro tours or you know, if you're playing really bad, you can pull out of them. You know, you're here for the long goal, um, and it, it is a brutal, brutal tournament. Um, it's ruined a lot of players, and it's made a lot of players. I think it's made me, um, but obviously. Certain players have, have, have come into the Premier League and it's absolutely ruined the career. And it's very tough because you're playing the best of the best every single night or every single week. And it's, you know, it's the, um, what's the word? It's like the, the flagship tournament of, of darts. It's the best of the best. And you don't want to be that guy or that, you know, them two guys that are getting absolutely battered every week because it's, it's not a nice feeling walking into that, that uh, practice room knowing that you're bottom of the league. But... Um, yeah, all I can say it is tough, and un unless you experience it, you don't realize how hard mental this is for, for us guys. But you know, uh, this is what we all want, so we can't moan about it. <laughs> and again, just the last one for me on, on your darts, your both winning averages have been high 90s. That must say to you in the back of your head, you know, you've made the right decision to switch back to old faithfuls. Yeah, I, I felt like I cheated on him. Um, you know, many a night we've, we've had a cuddle in bed saying. 
I'm sorry, they won't happen again. <laughs> um, you know, I've, I nurtured him and I put him at the side. <laughs> nah, listen, I was playing well with my other ones, uh, but it, it's just confidence. Um, and I know I can win stuff with these darts, and that's why I went back to them. And like I said, I'm not playing my top game yet, um, but, you know, there's still a long way to go in this tournament. And obviously, the more I'm playing, the more wins I'm getting, the more confident I'm getting. You know, I, I, I'm there. I'm nearly there. Back to back to um, how how I, how I can play. It's a pleasure as always, mate. Thank you very much. Thank you. Um, Nathan, we knew how much you were looking forward to playing Gerwin Price before the Premier League started. A little bit different playing James Wade, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, just a bit. Obviously, it's a completely different game. You know, I've, to be fair, I played three guys so far that I don't get anything back. Um, and you know, I, I'm a fiery guy on that stage, and I think apart from probably Michael, I don't, don't really think there's many guys that give it much on stage. So, you know, it could work two ways. Tonight, I've, 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 I've not given it anything at all, and I played really well. I was very composed through the whole game, excuse me, but um, yeah, I, yeah, I would have loved to play Gezzer tonight. Um, not if he beat me, but I would have loved to play him just for that adrenaline rush and that. that Good game of darts that me and him always have. On well, night five, you have got Michael Van Gerwen, and he seems to be roaring on that stage more than he has done for quite a while. I'm sure that's something you're going to be up for. Oh, definitely. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Obviously, I've got, I've got another difficult game. Maybe night's difficult, obviously, yeah. um, with, with Jose tomorrow. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to go there tomorrow, uh, get another two points, hopefully. And then I think probably come, come, come Friday, I'm well into the tournament. I'll be more relaxed and, uh, you know, if he wants to shout, I'll shout louder. And uh, <laughs> we, we, talked, uh, we talked before the tournament about expectations of other people outside and proving people wrong. We're three nights into the Premier League and it seems like you're proving people wrong already. Yeah, definitely. Um, I'm, uh, listen, these, it's nice that I've got no expectations on my shoulders. No one's expecting me. Well, no one's expecting me to get past the first nine nights. To be fair, but you know, certainly, no one's expecting me to make the top four. I'm, I'm expecting to make the top four, um, and that is my target. And um, every win that I, I get on that stage, I just laugh because all these people that are writing me off. It, it, it's uh, another two fingers up at them. Um, you know, I'm working hard to, to get back to where I was. I'm nearly there. I'm not quite, but I'm nearly there. And I'm winning games against the best players in the world. So, um, yeah, it gives me a lot of hunger and a lot of satisfaction when I win. No, brilliant. Cheers for your time, Nathan, and congrats on tonight. Nathan, congratulations on getting back to winning ways. At the end there, when James was starting to pull back, was there any nerves, especially from the night before? Uh, I, I wouldn't say nerves, but I'm playing Wade. He, he's like, the, he ruins you. <laughs> on anything like 90 to 130, you know he's got a shot and you know he, nine times out of ten he takes out at crucial times. He's absolutely hanging at it, <laughs> to be fair. Um, he's the best in the business at that, that you know, that, that array of kills. So, obviously, when he had that one two one, then I'm thinking this is going. Um, but I, I don't think there was nerves. I was... I always thought when I when I had the lead, I wouldn't let a lead slip like I did last night. Again, I wouldn't do that two nights on a bounce. Easy to say it now, but um, no, nah, I, I wasn't nervous. I just had to go up there and ping that double and get off that stage. Obviously, it was only 24 hours prior that you let the lead slip against Dimmy. Um, you said there that there wasn't any nerves. Was there any any thoughts about the game before in, in making sure that you didn't didn't want a repeat of that? Uh, no, I think I think maybe if I was like, say I was four one up against Dimmy and then lost, but I was three one down, could have been four one down. Um, you know, if it didn't take that one four four out, I would have been four one down. So it wasn't like I had a big lead and, and gave it away. I was lucky to be staying in the game, and then I got me a little bit of a lead. Um, but it was absolutely ridiculous starts from Dimmy last three legs. So, you know, as, as well as James is as good as James is, sorry. For someone to go 13, 11, 12, last three legs, two nights on the balance was very unlikely. And they always knew he had a 12 data in me if needed. Um, so now I, I, I wasn't I wasn't nervous. Um, I just wanted to get the job done and, and get off the stage and come spend half an hour with you guys. <laughs> <laughs> you love us guys. Uh, yeah. You certainly did get the job done. Reflecting on the performance, are you happy with what you produced tonight? 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I, I had my two legs that I always have every single game of absolute spanners. Just <laughs> don't know what happens because, like, I'll be playing really, really well the next minute. I'll, you know, I'll throw 12 darts right in the treble and it, it, it should. I don't know. It's weird. I've been playing it 10 years now and I've got a clue why it happens. But uh, no, nah, I'm happy with performance. You know, I'm scoring well. I'm hitting a lot of 180s. Um, you know, my finishing is pretty good. Um, yeah, I'm happy. I'm happy with my performance. Considering where I was six months ago, you know, I'm I'm happy with my game. It is four points from three games. Uh, you play Jose and Michael on the next two nights and then that's it for this first block. What are you hoping to achieve from these next two games? Um, well, two wins would be nice. <laughs> um, but no, nah, it's... I'm expecting a talk. I don't think I've ever played Jose, to be fair. Um, no, I might be wrong there. I don't think I've actually ever played him, but um, I'm, I'm expecting a tough game with Jose. He's had a difficult start, uh, especially if he loses tonight. What score is that now? Oh, he's 2-1 up at the moment. But um, yeah, if he was to lose tonight, there's a lot of pressure on him more than me. If I can get a win against him, I've got a lot of confidence going into to the final game. Um, but no, every night's a different night. Uh, I'm practicing well. I'm playing well on stage. I feel good. I'm happy. So uh, this is when I, I do damage normally.